Hello, God bless you. Let's talk about five things money cannot buy. Five things money cannot buy. Number one thing, before we even go into five things money cannot buy, let's talk about money itself. Money is a defense. Money is good. Money is very, very important in our lives. With money, you can do so much. With money, you can alleviate some unnecessary stress, uh, frustration. So money is good. We need money to be able to do life. So I am not against money and I'm not against you getting money as long as it's legit and it's clean. As long as you you understand that money itself is a, it's just a currency, it's a paper or numbers. And there are, there are much more other things that are much more important than money. Getting money is not even a big deal, in all fairness. Getting money, once you know the secrets, you can get money. Please, before I go on, I'd like you to subscribe to my channel, Yemi Aitibo YouTube channel. I'd like you to click the notification bell so that you can be notified when we post some con con content like this that can actually help you in life, both spiritually, physically, in marriage, and in finance. I'd like you to know that there are good stops, content here that you can consume that can actually channel your life to uh, where you want it to be. So please click the notification bell, like, and leave us a comment. If you want us to do some topics, leave us a comment, and then we'll be able to uh, know more of what you want. God bless you. So, like I said, money is good. Money is good. Money is great. You need money to do life you need money to uh, answer to so many things but then money is not everything so let's dive into five things that money cannot give to you number one peace of mind uh, i've seen so many people in, in my life that that um, are very very comfortable they are rich they are comfortable they are rich but they don't have peace of mind because i i cancel uh i've seen People coming to me uh, talking about the challenges they face in life, despite the fact that they are rich. So, if money does not automatically translate to peace of mind, as a matter of fact, if you are the type that pursue money, you will discover that you never have enough of the money you put of the money because there is not going to be a time that you're going to say i have i have enough i don't want to pursue that is why when you see people that are embezzling they can't stop embezzling because it's a spirit and the spirit behind money is never satisfied it's always asking for more so it is possible that you have money you have enough in, a, in, in your bank whatever and um, you have enough investment and still be deprived of the peace of mind so money cannot give you peace of mind i want you to know this uh, and begin to think about it and then in my next video we'll talk about things that can give you peace of mind number two money does not translate to long life having money does not translate to you um, being going to have a long life why because money can actually get you to um, begin to uh, run wild if you don't know how to manage it um, sudden success can actually cause havoc in somebody's life so when money comes unexpectedly it can lead to uh, some character, some attitude that uh, are not too good for, for you that may actually jeopardize your existence. So money itself doesn't guarantee long life in the sense that um, it does not guarantee how long you live. Even if, let's, let's, uh, let's even take for instance, you fall sick and you are diagnosed of an illness. And then you, you are taken to the hospital because you have money, the best hospital in the world and all that. It still doesn't guarantee that you are going to live long. Why? Because God is the one that determines how long you live. And how you treat your body will determine how long you live as well. So no matter how great you are, no matter how rich you are, um, the, the money you have does not translate to long life. We've seen so many people that had money and then they didn't live long. Um, in my country, uh, during the COVID, 
and it was told of some you know rich rich people rich guys that um had covid and then they did all they could some even chartered a airplane to go to travel to other countries to go and get um drug for them to be to be healed but it, they, they couldn't still make it so no matter how much of money you have you need to take care of your body you need to take care of your your life and you need to do good um the book the bible that i believe says he that desires long life and wants to see good many days she will desist from evil so money does not guarantee long life it can actually help you to live healthy to live well if you know what to do with the money but it still doesn't guarantee long life we will talk about the what guarantees long life number three true friendship money does not guarantee that you will have true friends as a matter of fact somebody said in fact the bible says that if you have money you have many friends and so and the bible says somewhere else it says if you have too many friends you have it you have them to your own detriment so what does that mean when money comes everybody wants to associate with you and because of this you don't even know those who are wishing you bad or wishing you good so having money does not translate to having good friends you may have influential friends you may have uh, um wealthy friends and all that but that doesn't mean that they are true they are true friends that doesn't mean that they don't want your done for that doesn't mean that they are not competing with you so when you begin to experience wealth money uh, i want you to begin to check these things check check the friends um that are, are around you check those who are attaching themselves to you check those who are um are submitting themselves to you uh you will find out that some of these people they don't really like you but they like what you have which is money and they know that um as long as they are in your good book uh you will they will always get something it's, it's also a, a a a kind of manipulative uh strategy uh when you see people flooding around you because you have money i want you to know that it's not because they love you it is because of what you have in your hand so money does not guarantee true friendship you have so many friends when you have money but i tell you probably 10 of them 10 percent of them are just true friends probably 10 or even less the rest are just um 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 seeker help seekers and that's that so please if you have not subscribed i'd like you to subscribe uh, to yemi itibo youtube channel and click the notification bell so that you can keep on enjoying um, our podcast and our content and please i like you to leave me a comment uh, on this video and um, tell us other things that money cannot um, give to you money cannot give to you or uh, money cannot buy so that we can also learn from you number four number four thing that money cannot guarantee that having money cannot give to you ultimately is power is power um i like you to know that money is good but i've seen it in my little life in my little experience in life that those who have money at some point in their life they begin to look insecure so they want to get power so it's some in fact it is it is it is said that power is much more important than money because those who have power can use the power to command money those who have power can use the power to deal with those who have money so as so, you can actually use money to get some little little power but when it gets to real power there are sacrifices to make it goes beyond money it goes beyond it goes beyond physical so money cannot guarantee you get you through power you may be able to have influence through your money but those influence may not even be permanent but when you get power you have permanent influence on people so money doesn't give you power money can pave a way for you to get power money can create an avenue for you to get the power but there are sacrifices to make um to to get power and money does not guarantee that you can send your money on her and but when it comes to power you have to do the needful to get the power whether you are a child of god or you are not in the kingdom or part of the kingdom kingdom at the moment money does not guarantee power but money can pave way so if you're going to get power there is a way to get power to get both spiritual and physical power to be influential in which money can be part of the tools that you can use to get power but ultimately 
money doesn't give power i've seen people that don't have money but they are very powerful and because they are powerful they are able to command whatever they need as at when they need it because of the power and they are able to get it so i would say money doesn't guarantee power but power can actually guarantee abundance and even give you money um that is that and the fifth one which is the last one i would like to discuss on this um, um video is money does not guarantee true fulfillment the money having money does not translate to you being successful no i've seen i've seen those some people do, who have money and they still fail in life they still fail in life i've seen in in, in this life those who had money um while alive and as soon as they died everything about it, about them died everything died so they were not successful and what is the definition of success you are not successful until your successor is successful you are not successful until uh, the people around you um, um confirm your success so so uh, when you look at money money is good money is good i've seen so many people i've seen many 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 that um, are comfortable they are comfortable but they there is this this there is this emptiness within them and when they come for counseling they tell you oh i know i have money but i know something is missing i know i have money but something is missing i'm, I'm just i'm just i'm just afraid i'm i'm, I'm feeling secure I, I don't know what it is it's because money does not translate to fulfillment or success money can help you to reach success and success is, sub is also subjective success is very subjective that is why money cannot be termed as a, as a success because money today uh can fly and then uh, disappear tomorrow so success is in the mind success is um the ability to 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 get to your goal and 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 being able to uh, uh reach that my milestone or or or, or, or a vision that you have set for yourself so that is success and it's subjective it is not final it is not fine that is why money um uh cannot be translated to uh, final success so i want you to know that uh, money is good but there are some things that money cannot give to you and which i have highlighted here in my next video i will be talking about how to have peace of mind how to have long life how to have true friendship how to have true power and what it what it means to be fulfilled in life I hope you enjoyed this. Please share this and then I'll be respecting your comment and God bless you. Bye.